Our other top story at this hour, brand new information we're learning in the robbery and sexual assault of two Dollar Tree workers on Detroit's east side. Police say this man right here attacked the two female employees shortly before closing time Monday night, forcing them to run across the street naked for help. Our Larry Spruill was back at the Dollar Tree on Van Dyke near 8 Mile today and found out the store is closed. The parking lot across the street is empty and no one is inside the store. Now it's been two days since two employees were robbed and sexually assaulted at this Dollar Tree store at Van Dyke in 8 Mile. Tonight, police are still looking for the suspect. Wednesday, metal barriers cover the front of this Dollar Tree store at the intersection of Van Dyke and 8 Mile. It's the same store where Detroit police say this man robbed two female employees, ages 43 and 56, Monday night around 9.51 p.m. Detectives say the suspect entered the store close to closing time and walked up to the counter like he was going to buy something. That's when he pulled out a gun and forced the two women towards the back office. He then demanded money from the safe. After he got the money, he sexually assaulted both victims and then ran away. Now, I talked to one woman via Facebook after she posted she almost hit two barefoot, naked women running across Van Dyke by the store Monday night. She says she helped them inside this restaurant across the street and gave them some clothes to wear. She then called police. But again, take a good look at this suspect. Police say he is a black male, about 5'5". He was wearing a black hoodie blue khaki pants, and bright white shoes. I reached out to Dollar Tree and the media relations team sent me this statement. It says that we are distressed by the reported incident and we are cooperating with law enforcement's investigation. Our company is offering a $5,000 reward for any information leading to an arrest. We are on Detroit's side tonight. Larry Sproul, Local 4.